Is there anyone out there? Have you ever gazed at the stars and pondered on the existence of extraterrestrial life? This cosmic question has intrigued minds for centuries, a question that tugs at our curiosity and our sense of adventure. We are, after all, explorers by nature. The universe, a vast expanse of cosmic wonder, is filled with an estimated two trillion galaxies, each teeming with billions of stars. We're just a tiny speck in this grand cosmic ballet, but even so, the possibility that we're not alone is enchanting. Imagine for a moment the potential for diverse life forms, civilizations possibly far advanced than ours, or perhaps just microbial organisms surviving in the harshest of environments. Our quest to uncover the truth about extraterrestrial life is not just a pursuit of knowledge, but a journey to understand our place in the universe. Today, we embark on a journey through time to understand our search for life beyond Earth. Our curiosity about the cosmos is as ancient as the stars themselves. When we gaze up at the night sky, we're participating in a ritual that our ancestors have been engaged in for millennia. They, too, pondered the twinkling orbs of light scattered across the heavens, awed by their mysterious beauty and vastness. Ancient civilizations weren't just captivated by the stars, they wove them into their cultures and beliefs. The Mayans, for instance, believed in a cosmos brimming with celestial deities, while the Egyptians envisioned the stars as the eternal resting place of the soul. For them, the universe was teeming with life, albeit of a divine, otherworldly kind. The Greeks, on the other hand, took a more scientific approach. They pioneered the study of astronomy, turning their fascination with the cosmos into an intellectual endeavor. They sought to understand the mechanics of the universe, laying the groundwork for the astronomical knowledge we have today. But the concept of life beyond Earth didn't truly take hold until the Renaissance. As our understanding of the universe began to shift, so did our perspective on our place within it. We were no longer at the center of the cosmos, but just one small planet orbiting a rather average star. This humbling realization sparked a tantalizing question. If we're not unique, then could there be other planets like ours, teeming with life? And so, the search for extraterrestrial life was born out of a blend of ancient fascination and modern scientific thought. It was fueled by the age-old human traits of curiosity and the desire to understand our place in the universe. Indeed, our early curiosity about the cosmos has shaped our collective quest for knowledge. It has led us on a journey of discovery, from gazing at the stars with wonder, to scanning the heavens with powerful telescopes in search of signs of life. As our understanding of the universe expanded, so did our quest to find life beyond our planet. The 20th century marked the dawn of the space age, a time of discoveries and new possibilities. As humanity entered the 1900s, a new era of exploration was on the horizon. The spark that ignited this revolution was the launch of Sputnik, the world's first artificial satellite. In 1957, the Soviet Union catapulted us into the space age, launching Sputnik into Earth's orbit and marking the beginning of our journey into the great unknown. Sputnik's successful launch signified a monumental leap for mankind. It was a testament to human ingenuity and determination, a symbol of our yearning to reach beyond the confines of our home planet. Suddenly, the stars weren't so far out of reach. Space was no longer a distant dream, but a tangible frontier, ready to be explored. But Sputnik was just the beginning. As the decades rolled on, our reach extended further into the cosmos. The late 1970s saw the launch of the Voyager missions, two spacecraft designed to explore the outer planets and beyond. These missions were humanity's first grand tour of the solar system, capturing stunning images of Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune. Yet Voyager was more than just a sightseeing tour. Aboard each spacecraft was a golden record, a time capsule of sorts, filled with sounds and images selected to portray the diversity of life and culture on Earth. These golden records were our first messages to any extraterrestrial life that might stumble upon them. Greetings in 55 languages, music from Mozart to Chuck Berry, sounds of waves crashing and babies crying, all meant to say, we are here, this is us. The space age was a time of astonishing progress and unprecedented exploration. It was a time when we looked up at the stars and dared to venture forth. 
It was a time when we not only explored the cosmos, but also sought to communicate with it. As technology advanced, so did our methods of searching for extraterrestrial life. In the 21st century, our search for extraterrestrial life has taken exciting turns. Our methods have evolved drastically, and with new technologies at our disposal, we're able to explore the farthest reaches of the cosmos like never before. One cutting-edge approach is the hunt for exoplanets, planets that orbit stars outside of our own solar system. With advanced telescopes, we're able to spot these distant worlds, some of which may hold conditions suitable for life. We've found thousands of exoplanets, and among them are a select few that sit in the so-called Goldilocks zone. Not too hot, not too cold, but just right for life as we know it. But our search isn't confined to the stars. We're also looking closer to home, studying the most extreme environments on our own planet. We're examining extremophiles, organisms that thrive in conditions too harsh for most life forms. From the scorching heat of volcanic vents to the freezing depths of the Antarctic ice, these hardy critters show us that life can exist in the most unexpected places, expanding our understanding of where it might be found elsewhere in the universe. Leading this endeavor are major institutions like the Search for Extraterrestrial Intelligence, or SETI, and the National Aeronautics and Space Administration, better known as NASA. These organizations, armed with cutting-edge technology and brilliant minds, are at the forefront of our quest to answer the cosmic question, are we alone in the universe? Yet, despite our best efforts and the incredible strides we've made, the answer remains elusive. The universe is vast, and our search is like looking for a needle in an astronomical haystack. But we're not discouraged. Every new discovery, every exoplanet found, every extremophile studied, brings us one step closer to potentially finding life beyond our planet. Our search continues, fueled by our insatiable curiosity and thirst for knowledge. The journey may be long and fraught with challenges, but the potential reward, the discovery of extraterrestrial life, makes the journey worth every light year. What does the future hold for our search for extraterrestrial life? As we gaze into the cosmos, we can't help but wonder about the potential future methods that could be employed in our quest to find extraterrestrial life. The future of this search is as vast and infinite as the universe itself, promising a journey filled with innovation, exploration, and discovery. In the coming years, we'll see a plethora of missions to Mars and other celestial bodies. These missions, planned by space agencies worldwide, aim to probe deeper into the enigmatic corners of our own solar system. Mars, with its similarities to Earth, continues to be a prime focus. The Red Planet has already been subject to numerous rovers and orbiters, with future missions planning to return samples to Earth for more detailed study. Yet, our search isn't limited to Mars. The icy moons of Jupiter and Saturn, such as Europa and Enceladus, are also considered potential habitats for life. They are believed to harbor vast subsurface oceans, which could possibly sustain life. The planned missions to these intriguing moons could provide us with invaluable insights into the existence of life beyond Earth. In this era of rapid technological advancements, the role of artificial intelligence and machine learning can't be overstated. These technologies could potentially revolutionize the way we search for extraterrestrial life. For instance, they could help us analyze vast amounts of data from space telescopes, identifying patterns and signals that might indicate the presence of life. The future also holds the promise of advanced space telescopes, more powerful and precise than ever before. These marvels of technology will peer deeper into the universe, looking for signs of life in distant exoplanets. The future of the search is not just about where we look, but also how we look. As we continue our cosmic journey, who knows what we might discover next? As we reach out to the stars, we may find that we are not alone in this vast universe. And in doing so, we might just redefine our understanding of life itself. Our journey through time has brought us from ancient curiosity to modern exploration. We've journeyed through the centuries, from the early wonderment of our ancestors as they gazed at the stars, to the birth of the space age and the first steps we took beyond our own planet. We've seen how our search for alien life has evolved, utilizing cutting-edge technology and the brightest minds to delve into the mysteries of the cosmos. 
Today, we stand on the brink of new discoveries. Our eyes firmly set on the future. Yet, we must remember that our quest is far from over. The search for extraterrestrial life is a testament to our enduring spirit of exploration, our insatiable curiosity that pushes us to venture beyond the known. Each day brings us closer to answering the cosmic question, are we alone in the universe? While we may not have found definitive proof of extraterrestrial life yet, our search continues. The universe is vast and we've only just begun to explore it.